Well, I have a lot. Uh, I, I have, uh, I've been, uh, um, I was for many, many years on the periphery of the music industry, uh, and um, that, that again is part of my college experience. Los Angeles actually was sort of a second home to me long before I went to Caltech because I had spent a lot of time in recording studios and, and um, uh, though I play neither wisely nor well, um, <laughs> I play often. <laughs> so so uh, uh, having had a lot of friends in the industry who actually were talented, uh, that, that made it possible for me to, you know, sit in. Um, so I continue to do that quite a bit and those friendships endure uh, and I'm still fairly active in your particular in, instrument. Uh, you know, I play a lot of instruments, but I usually play keyboards. Um, but, you know, I've played a lot of instruments. Now, it sounds like, at least in Seattle, you were a sailor. Uh, yeah, but I, was, I, I, I used to sail a lot. In fact, I taught it at one point and for, you know, uh, for, uh, you know, um, sailing dinghies in particular. Um, but, uh, it, you know, that requires an enormous amount of effort. In Seattle, I had a beautiful um, pocket sloop, a 26-foot wooden boat, William Garden design, built at the Edison Boat Building School, uh, Port Orford Cedar, and copper fastenings. And just to varnish the tow rails on that boat would take me like 16 hours, you know, of rocking on the boat, <laughs> cutting in. <laughs> and that's just, you know, for three coats. I mean, we're not talking about Bristol condition here. It's, it's too much work. It's impossible. So, though I've enjoyed it in the past, I haven't done it for years. Uh, so it's mainly music. It's mainly music, yeah. Right.